What's up everyone, it's Pope Terry here again for day 24, Woo, 24 of Terry's Descent into Madness. Yesterday, for day 23, we played SCP Containment Breach, and today, day 24, no idea what we're playing yet. If you've been with me since day one, you know that my hands are tied. My fate is held within this bastard random spinning wheel of peril, of doom, of misfortune, of nightmares. But before we spin the wheel, I'm shuffling the wheel, mixing things up a bit, randomising this bitch. Only 26 games left on this list. We started out with what, 49, maybe? I can't remember. I think it was 49. Yeah, no, maybe. Who knows? We're now down at 26. With only a few days left. What was it? Six. Seven days left? Ooh, only a week left of this bitch. Ha oh, ha! Then it's November. Christ! Couple of shuffles. Fear! And let's spin this wheel. We've still got all those Five Nights at Freddy's left. We've got a couple of Resident Evils. Got Outlast 2 and Outlast Whistleblower. Oh, God. What nightmares await me. Let's spin that wheel. What have we got? What have we got? What have we got? What have we got? Oh, God. No. Keep going. Keep going. Ah, you bitch. So we've somehow landed on all three of the Amnesia games. Of course we have. Of course we have. So today, for day 24 of Terry's Descent into Madness, we're playing Amnesia Machine for Pigs. <laughs> of course we are. Of course we are. Oh, hell's bastard bells. Oh, let's get into it, shall we? Let's head on over for Amnesia Machine for Pigs. Right then, so here we are for day 24 of Terry's Descent into Madness, and we are playing Amnesia, a machine for pigs. I don't think I've seen anything for this one. Not that I'm aware of. I know there's some, like, piggy monsters at some point in the game, but other than that, I've got no idea what this one's about. Like, I had no idea what the other two were about. Haha! <laughs> But now this is finally the third and final game that is on Terry's Descent into, Mad into Madness like listy thing from the random spinning wheel. So no more Amnesia games, although Amnesia Rebirth has just come out within the last few days so that will probably be on next year's list if I do one next year. We will see how things go. Anyway, let's start this bitch shall we? New game. I have a feeling this one's going to be more of a full game compared to Just Seen, because Just Seen was quite short. We got that done in under an hour. I think. Yes, maybe. I have no idea. Loading! Is there a reason there's a heart? I don't know what all those bits are. My missus would know. She'd be a nurse. She'll know what all those bits are. Rules beginning, is it? He who makes a beast of himself removes himself from the pain of being human. Doctor Jesus, Doctor Samuel Johnson. Ooh. Daddy. Daddy. Please don't kill me. Sounds like an old man. How old's his dad? Jesus. What is going on already?
Hello? Am I locked up or something? Why am I in a cage? That was a very brief intro to the game. Someone been drinking. Ugh. Oh god, what is with all the leaning in these games? Jesus. That looks like an ominous drawer. Or chest of drawers, I should say. Either I'm very short, or I'm like hunched over or something, because I'm nearly as tall as this bloody table. Yes, I know how to open things. I have played the previous two games. Jesus. Ah, oh, uh, Jesus, I can't read that. June is it 24th, 1899. Oh, so this is the furthest in the future. Yes, because Justine was the 1850s, yes, no, maybe, possibly, who knows. I don't know when Dark Descent was set. In my dreams, I see a man dressed in jaguar skin and feathered like a blooded saint. What came from the heart lubricated us. This is sounding weird already. It crushed evil under its tread and liberated us all. The... F what word does that... It's... Futid? 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 The futid heat of the jungle. Mirrored somewhere behind my forehead, my temple pounds, the blood boils in my skull. It feels as if there is something alive there, a rat, a damn rat gnawing through my brains, eating its way out into the world. Even the laudanum will not quell its endless hunger. I hear my children playing in the attic, but it fills me with terror, not love. What desperate thoughts are these? Right, okay. This man's a nutcase. Bible. Booze. Can't take the Bible out of the... Biblia. Mm. More books. This is a funky set of drawers, this. Piggy head! Is that a... Th Ooh, fancy radiator. Is that pig a thing of what's to come? Oof, Jesus. Daddy, Daddy, find us. Oh, this is very different. A fever dream. I wake alone to a house in silence. That missing sound of children playing. It's like a dark and... Whatever those words are. I can't read it from here. Beckoning me to begin a descent to the... Loam where surely only bodies may be found. I just no idea. No matter. My children call, I shall answer. I will find them. Okie dokie, arty chokey. I'm coming, my children. You in the bathroom? Right. Oh, we don't have our inventory. Oh, that's interesting. Can't seem to open the drawers. This is very different compared to the previous two, isn't it? A little, yes. Papa, Papa, this way. No, let me explore the rest of the place first before I follow you. Can't go through there. Can't go through there. Why do all the your hand beds have cages? Between your legs. You lived long enough to see Edwin, but not Enoch. I will take care of them, my love. I promise you this. Oh, I'm betting you didn't have a chair?
What's with the pigs? Glasses. What's with the pigs? There's many a pig. Many a pig adorn this place. It is six o'clock. Or half twelve, whatever that said. Oh god, another chair's in the way. Ugh. Right. Currently no way downstairs, so upstairs we go. What are the controls for this one? Oh, Jesus, what happened there? Right. Uh, throw, run, interact, menu, rotate. As a rotate? Oh, is that things you pick up? <laughs> Silly bastard. Right. Not as much stuff to interact with in this game, is there? I said open. What was that? What's with the pigs? Attics and nurseries, but they slept in the attic when they were babies in arms. Babes in arms, shut up. And perhaps they've hidden there now. I remember I insisted upon it midway between my bedroom and my office. Is it me or is the world going a bit funny? What sort of funny, Terence, dear? Lights. their cages on the beds. Can we jump over the side? Doesn't seem it. Oh, you silly pleb. My liver. Children! Am I a bad man? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Edwin and Enoch's diary, October 11th, 1899. Daddy says there won't be a Christmas this year. There won't be a Christmas this year, either the way things are going. He is much too busy. <laughs> Nanny says we must not disturb him. He is ever so busy. He has gone for work before she wakes us, and often we are asleep before he returns. We found a bird in the garden with a broken wing. We gave it to Nanny, who said it was a filthy thing and hit it with a rolling pin. Bitch. 
Later we crept downstairs to bury the body when everyone was asleep. There was a pig in the garden. We heard it snuffling about. Then Daddy came and said we had to come inside straight away. He was furious, but we think he'd been crying again. Teddy bear! Hello? Got a Bible I can throw at you? Some blocks? Ooh, that's eerie. Someone's been numbing on rats. Filth. Utter filth. Right. Another piggy. Ugh. Oh god, now I can't get past. Right. Um. Ugh. Ugh. Come on. Yes. Look at me go. What's with the pigs? We're hiding, Daddy. Jesus. Oh God, now I'm trapped. No. Beautiful. Ooh. What's with these locky things? Child locks? That's a very strange looking thing. They've stopped rocking. So they have house there be a lion why is it ominous crying shush now ghostly children Is this the nanny's room? Yes, drawers. Nothing in them apart from all these fucking books. And booze. Books and booze. No cage on this bed. Lucky sod. Out the window. No, that would be far too easy. This is a big fucking house. Jesus, where, do we, where are we living? Daddy. Yes. I don't even know if I am the dad. I could be a bad man. Am I the bad man? Why is there a pig in the suit? There's no one playing that piano. Fancy piggies. Dog. You don't mind if I record this, do you? I find it most useful. Ah, you have one of those wonderful command head builds. Uh, no, of course not, my dear fellow. It's my own design, Professor, along with everything you see. Most useful. You understand, of course, where the Ministry sent me. That they have concerns. Concerns about what? Don't stop it there. Teas. Uh, some Aztec looking shit. Clickety clock. This looks like some very occult looking shit. Right then. A 
That was a bit extreme, wasn't it? Turn the fire off. Can I take the gun, please? I may need that. Someone's been playing poker. Have my children been gambling? It's very rude of them not to invite me. No, nothing going that way. So this door it is. Come out, my tiddlywinks. Where art thou hiding? Genie. Ooh, a telephone. Hello, indeed. Hello. Precious eagle cactus fruit. Help us. What? I'm sorry, no cactus fruit here, lover. I'm afraid you're a bit off your rocker. What's all, all the booze in these games? Jesus. November 7th. 1898. The bank is refusing credit. The ignorant swine. I sit alone at night and weep. Once the children and servants are safely asleep, and they cannot hear me, my darling, how I need you now. They say I have squandered my fortune, that my investment in these latest machines has ruined the family name. What? That was... That, was, that I was to remain a local butcher. Ah, that, that's why the pigs are coming into it then. What are those two arms compared to the multitude that can be applied without pay, without tire? By adapting the mechanisms we find in the looms and the mills. But if the bank has its way, it will all come to nothing. If they come for the house, I swear I will kill them. I will kill them all. I will take my rifle. My rifle! What did that do? Oh! Secret door. Did the others move? No, just this one. Hello, hello, hello. Children, darlings. This is a freaky place, is it not? Clockwork and the soul. Replacement is dissatisfactory. Dis dissatisfactory. Jesus. I'm having such difficulty reading some stuff in these last few games. So like a pump. Better the intestinal canal, like a tapeworm. Lovely. Already hosting intrusion and the breed. Brass, better than copper. More resistant. Filaments sewn in... Bone hold? don't know what these are. Marrow pipe removal with needle potential. Composite replacement straightforward. Will respond to electromagnetic in inducement to increase yield rate. Serum provides accelerated resetting resulting in naturalized movement within two to three days. Subject still requires severing of frontal lobes to reduce emotional distress upon reactivation. Damn it, damn it, damn this wretched soul. If it only were clockwork. Someone's making monsters and taking out their brains. The fuck is all this shit? This dawning epoch, this age of reason, an empire grown fat, ripe for the bleeding. What does this do? I've no idea. going on? Who are you? Who are these poor bastards? Oh, Jesus. That's a fancy sink. Look at that shit.
in Lily's honour a banquet for glassy orbs fixed upon a point in heaven. Wipe down your trousers, man. There is blood in this sweat and it's most unseemly. Most unseemly. Whatever. Righty, righty, right. Why is the game telling me to run? That surely cannot be a good sign. This way, Papa. Come and see. Which way is this way, my child? Can I just go out the front doors and leave? Is that an option? None of these bastard doors open, they're all like bolted shut. These are funky looking locks. Downstairs, I guess. Oh, the weeping rooms, where once we sat to weep Lily's passing under weapons that cannot slay the angels to retrieve her from heaven. Look beyond the paintings, Oswald, where once you watched her bathe, the children must have discovered those secret places and taken refuge there. Grand Hall! That voice on the telephone, he speaks as if he knows me, and indeed I seem to remember him, like a twin pulled away from the other at birth. I feel we are entwined, though I cannot conceive of how. I am, am I, I am a drowning man, gasping for the surface. No, grasping, Terry. Grasping, Jesus Christ, for the surface. Within my own house, beneath me, I know there are splendid architectures hidden in the dark. If only I can find the entrances. Right, okay. He's a madman. Can we leave? Oh no, turn them on. Let me out. Just go through the windows. That was eerie. Not. Someone's knocked my painting off the wall. Not very nice, was it? Another piano. That was. Fuck knows. No piggy on this man. Take a knife, can take some cutlery to defend myself from future monsters, no? Well that's a bitch. And where does this secret passage go? Mandus, do you know me? Who are you? 
Where are my children? Trapped, Mandus. Far below us. The machine is fouled. It is breached. It is flooded. The bulkheads are down. The children are engaged. If you help me, I can help you release them. Restore the power, Mandus. Drain the flooding and restart the great engines. How? Where should I go? Hello? Hello? If it's your machine, surely you should know how to start the engines. No? I must say, my dear man, you, you look awful. Yes, sir. I seem to have picked up something rather nasty in this one. I do understand what you've been through. A lesser man would have crumbled. Yet you have made all of this. Your great factory, your charities. It is a wonder for one man alone. It will all be made clear, Professor. But first, a drink. People do love their booze in this, these games, don't they? Now we've made our way around. Oh, we did not finish going this way, did we? Voices. Jesus, we can go outside. No, thank you. <laughs> Antisha, Hippopotamus, butterflies. What a odd collection of animals and a bear. We can move the bear. The bear would be blocking the path. That was not spooky at all. Right. My journal. On bears and bathtubs. And after the party, she sh took my arm and said, But darling, however did you get... However did you get from the trophy room to the guest bathroom so quickly? Everyone considers you quite the magician, my darling. Lilibeth. My father's house has many rooms, as and as for mine, well, it also has a secret chambers. Righty ho ho. Kaka kaka kaka. Ah, so that goes to here. Ah. Good. A note. December 20th, 1899. I am to have a visitor. A distinguished professor. A. He is to come and ascertain my mental well-being after my prolonged absence from the club. But I am not stupid. He is here to spy for them when they stalked the Ripper. He was often called to pontif pontificate upon Jesus Christ upon lacerations and missing organs. Now he f now he comes to me th to doff and wheedle and my dear sir, and you must still grieve and perhaps just a quick look at your engines. The triumph of the age. He knows nothing of loss, nothing of sacrifice, but to refuse that would simply poke the hornet's nest. Invite a swarm of interlopers and thieves. I must entertain this buffoon and submit to his intrusion. 
but perhaps I should show him the the tripery to see whether his stomach, so trained by rummaging in the innards of clumsily vivisected whores, is that whores? Looks it, is sh strong enough to stare into the real engines of the golden age. I may even introduce him to Jack, or his sons at least. We have stronger locks on the windows now, and we bring their toys to them. What is this shit? Who's Jack and his children? Are they the piggies? I hope not. Why would you name them? What is going on? Right, into the secret passage. Sounds like that did something. What that did, I've got no idea. I'm sure we'll soon find out. Hello? Not going in that door? No, sir. -y. Another bathroom. Jesus. What's been going on back here? Is this my room? The fuck is that on the bed? I don't know, Cherry. I do not know then. Something's out. And that was My hands are bleeding, raw. I scrub and scrub, but the smell will not lift. How can I hold my children with these hands now? How can I kiss them good night with lips that have issued such instruction? Ah, 
Old Sally I, the doll's cottager. I am not singing a tune. Is she come a shuffling? Is that shuffling or sounding? Suffling? Snuffling? No idea. Lovely. Does that mean I'm one of the piggy people? Because I was asleep in a cage. Oh, I've got no idea. No, it still can't go in that one. No, nope, can't turn that anymore. That's a harpy eagle. Big old spider. Can't move this one. Ugh. What the fuck? That's different. And how do I get there now? Oh, gotcha. I'm off now. I will cry all the way home. I will have none. I will have none at all. Got no idea what you're on about, mate, but whatever, Trevor. Why weren't these open a minute ago? Unless someone has come this way. A curious discovery. Metal ticking as it cools and contracts. This must be the strange machine my new friend told me of. If my children discovered this place, it's entirely conceivable they strayed down woods, delighted in the discovery. Very well, it seems my route is predestined. The descent begins. No more descents. We've had enough descension. Thank you very much. The fuck is all this?
Back outside, are we? Not going in there. And that was... Found an egg. Jesus. Why are these games so eerie? It's weird. Against rising waters, send the trap catcher. Kosh the old man, sink him in a barrel of gin. When he's all mixed up and the bones turn to jam, we'll raise a glass kindly to him. What is this weird shit? Why are you turning a man into jam? Can't be a very nice taste in jam. Made of old man. Old man jam. <laughs> Jesus thought it frozen. Sound just went. Entered the cellars in amnesia, a machine for pigs. Or oh, what's in the cellars? Horrors, I imagine. Sheer and terrible horrors. Right. Still got a lantern. Beautiful. Got plenty of booze, so I'm sorted. Fucking rude. Trapped. Was it a trick? That voice on the phone? Who seems so close to my own? Who does... Who seems to know me so well? Does he lead me for a nefarious purpose of his own secret devising? But do I have a choice, even though his motives are unknown to me? I must find my boys. I will follow the machinery down to the very core of the earth if it will lead me to Edwin and Enoch. I'm coming, children. A ring a ding ding. The shaking ground you feel is our attempts to clear the flood waters. Treachery, Mandus. We were undone. Your children are trapped by this act. You must find them before it is too late. What do you need me to do? How can I find them? Always deeper, Mandus. Through the piston room and into the tunnels. Then find the bilge and flush the rotten water. I will help you where I can. But you must be swift, my little friend. <laughs> Swift. Fucking swift. Jesus, what is this place? Why is that having a roll around? The fuck was that?
the fuck? Can't lift the bar up. Rude. Was there anything else in here before? Oh, there's another one there. No idea what that did, but we'll soon see. And what did that do? I'm not liking the footsteps. If they even are feet. Keep it together, house. Barrage of Barrels of Doom. Please. Sod the children. <laughs> They're probably ghosties anyway. Bollocks, we need to bring a fuse up here. And that was? Saboteur had been this way. Intriguing, the gates are far too heavy for a man to, to lift, and are instead hoisted aloft by a chain coiled around a tube that appears to be spun by motors connected to these electrical switches. While the fuse is blown, the motor cannot be spun, and the gates will remain impenetrable. Will remain an impenetrable barrier to progress. More electrical sabotage. Another confounded fuse box. The fellow is furrowed in his sabotage, if somewhat repetitive. The stench from these barrels is quite discomforting. I would certainly hope that whatever chemistry this room is designed to store is not a defining feature of the flood that threatens my children. We can only hope, mate.
Yes, look at that. The path is clear. It seems the chemical processor is merely one part of a much larger complex. No easy route for me then. I will follow my fever, the course of my children wherever they may lead me, as I move further into this strange empire. What was this way? August 19th, 1899. Von Reichenbach writes of the Odic OD Force, Odic Force, whatever. Whilst that ignorant charlatan Blavatsky Punit Putrificated, Punificated, whatever. Upon the soul. They are both cretins to think one could strive for such great heights without wading through first through pulse and innard without standing upon an architecture of honest of no, an architecture of bones, not bloody honest. Jesus, some of these words look very weird. Montezuma was the wiser, but here, in our temples of steel, I have witnessed the severed head of a man, recently trampled to death by a runaway carriage, immersed in a solution of the Brennenberg compound. Ooh, Brennenberg. Immersed in a solution of the Brennenberg compound, opened his eyes and cried, Oh, where are my legs, sir? Where is my body? We are breaking through the barriers of death itself. Oh, my dead darling Lily, it is too late for you, but I promise you this. I will save our children from death, and if need be, I will wrench them back from the blackness with this wonderful concoction. So are the children dead, or...? Right then. Onward. Uh, what is that? Was that one of the piggies or one of the children? Follow us, Papa. We know the way. I don't trust you to show me the way. Thank you very much, child. What happened here? Hold still, for God's sake, hold still, child. Don't let it get into your eyes. I'm going to rinse it out now. There. It will be fine. You just need to lie down. Enoch, look to your brother. How many times have I told you not to play in the cellar? Saw like a blue note then for a second. Maybe not. My eyes are deceiving me now. What's all the, the dead rats? I told you he'd come. Extraordinary. Quite extraordinary. And you brought it all. The god man. He had been busy. It is wonderful how tragedy focuses the mind. What else was I to do? Fall into grief, pine, and fade in my hopelessness? Why not then simply die in that jungle amongst those dead temples?
right, none of them move, so I'm going to have to do this one. Most bizarre. The neck, the noose! Two cups of flour, one cup of water, a pinch of salt, a handful of mints, a bay leaf, a herb, a skeleton key for the nursery, and a mixing will go together. Right, okay. That makes very little sense, but whatever. Ding ding. Distribution clerk. I'm coming. I have such visions to share with thee. If my jaw be unshackled and you harvest the crust from my eyes, it can be clean madness that my thoughts and words can unfounded be. Who is this bizarre motherfucker? It's going to turn out to be me, isn't it? Talking to myself, or it's my twin, or something. Factory offices, all this just suggestions of a large workforce, yet no actual signs of life. It is every bit as if someone has attempted to carefully create the illusion of a working factory complex. Yet this facade, when examined closely, is clearly just a falsification. But I must put aside my anxieties, quell the unease that pits my stomach, and continue on my path. Shush. Can't interact with you, so you're going to have to keep going. Why is there teeth and glasses? Why did I just sort of fly? A note. August 22nd, 1899. In America! They talk of building their cities to the skies. To me this seems folly, but perhaps it is simply a case of na a nation found founded without a history of its own. We walk upon our histories. They are compacted into the very loam beneath our feet. The engineers we employed talked of this. They tailor of they talked of how when building the underground trains they would often come across older tunnels, crisscrossing the capital. What palaces lie buried beneath us? We are digging, 
digging, excavating, and reappropriating what we find. At the centre of the planet, my architect tells me there is a great iron ball. It is the egg of the world. Yes, many a mile beneath the Earth's crust, past the mantle and past the inner and outer core. A bathroom. How oh, beautiful. We have nothing in here. What a surprise. Oh, look. Back outside. October 11th, 1899. We integrate the very latest knowledge of chemistry using low levels of laudanum derivative in a feed to subdue the product even before initi the initiation of the process. I can't. Some of the letters are so close together they will blur. This means that we drag them from holding pens onto the line. They are less likely to panic and damage machine components, other products or themselves. This section of the belt is sheathed in rubber and kept well lit to maintain good spirits, and we have actually found that the intelligent placement of gramophones and s simple acoustic amplification tubes around the line means that we can use music to further soothe the product. We find Debussy particularly effective in this regard. What are they doing to these poor bastards? Well, we've only seen one of them so far. And that was horrifying. Piggies! Aww. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor piggies. Pumping station. It appears to be some kind of fueling station. I have seen automobiles demonstrated at Mr. Yarnum in Mr. Simmons's works, but the smell here is all wrong. This is not petroleum. Of that I am sure. Everything suggests to me that this machine must be significant in some way. Oh. What does it pump, eh? What does it pump? Locketed. Open! Note. September 28th, 1899. Imagine, they say, a machine one day that might think like a man. As if this is to be desired. One might almost boast of creating a man who breeds like a pig. Men and women upon all fours, rutting carelessly, ejaculating their filthy little missives into the streets. Jesus. Alleys and gutters running freely with the careless spill of their conjoinings. The air thick with the whimperings of lust. Body streaked with their own emissions, we have created a world where man is so utterly debased he will spray his seed over passers by. <laughs> what the fuck is this? And yet, this is the condition Babbage aspired to. No, this is out of the machine we seek. Such an ent entity should be nothing less than a deity, and we would fall upon our knees and worship it. We shall not carve gods to bicker and fornicate. They will exist to clean the world and set us free. I reject Babbage as I reject these men of government. Let the pigs copulate in the gutters whilst they can. We shall scoop them up and ease their ascension soon enough. What the fuck are you on about? What's with the rats? Why are you having pigs ejaculate on passers-by? What is going on? This is getting random, this game. Well, that's not going to do anything, is it? Doesn't seem it. Right. I am going to stop it there. Because it's been going on for a while now, I believe. Anyway, this has been day 24 of Terry's Descent into Madness, and we have been playing Amnesia, a machine for pigs. It's bloody weird, this one, especially towards the end. About making people into piggies and making them 
breed in the streets and ejaculate over passers-by. This is weird, this one. Very weird. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like, give it a share, and head over to, head over to the channel for more videos that you may enjoy. And also subscribe to the channel, that would be most helpful. Head over to the Facebook page, give that a like, so you can keep up to date with all things Terry related, like new videos, old videos, news, and when the things get delayed, just like a couple of these videos. Anyway, join me tomorrow for day 25 of Terry's Descent into Madness. No idea what we are playing next, as with every day, but still, join me tomorrow for that. And if you would like me to continue Amnesia and Machine for Pigs, let me know down in the comments below. But other than that, that's it from me. So long, farewell.